So if you're like me and you grew up in the era when computers made this type of noise, then you may have been as unfortunate as I to have played Jimmy Neutron versus Jimmy Negatron. I haven't played this game in a very long time, so I'm very excited. Sorry for the horrible looking stream, it was my first time, it's not my fault. Obama? So basically the story starts off with Jimmy complaining about Mrs. Fowl not being that interesting, but it just sounds like they've never used actual microphones before to record video games. Wow, I am constantly amazed by Miss Fowl's ability to make something as exciting as science sound so boring. Like, I know you guys are at Nickelodeon headquarters, just borrow one of their microphones, don't record games with a toaster. Can't anything ever be different? Oh, but it can be. And somewhere in another dimension, things are different. Very different. What? Man, that last name sounds super problematic. Listen, listen, Jay, it's just gamer words. It's just gamer words. Hey, it worked! Urgh. Must have had the flexing code wrong again. Yes! Perfect timing. It's, it's pretty difficult to put into words how disgusted I am, how depressed I am. Grows a seedy mo and goatee combo and believes that makes him more attractive. It do, though. It do, though. For a ten-year-old, it's pretty impressive. And the little hands. He reminds me of Evil Patrick. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Okay, so this the controls of this game is shit. So no mouse controls. Well, you can, but the mouse controls are weird. The mouse, like, if you move the mouse forwards, the character moves forwards. Like, the mouse is, like, basically the keypad. Man, the drift on the... He just keeps drifting. Oh, he's... Dr Man, Jimmy do be drifting, though. Oh gosh, these controls! But it feels like it's made out of water balloons. Oh, video game, stop, stop, video game. Right. Hell yeah, my aim was just about that time. So after being kidnapped and escaping from his weird underground lab, Jimmy sets off after Jimmy Negatron back into I think his own universe. It doesn't it doesn't make it that clear because he's taunting you about Cindy. I'm very uncomfortable by all of this. Come on, man! Uh-oh, doesn't look like the museum to me. We're still in Negatron's dimension from the look of things. <laughs> if you look behind you, you'll notice a ton of water just ready to spill over. Oh, it's the flashing! Oh my eye! What is this? Speed! Rock! My goodness. The 4 FPS. So this is what it feels like to have epilepsy. <laughs> oh, the yummy textures. Waterfall, dude. That was close. After narrowly escaping a waterfall with only my life and my two little boots in hand, Jimmy sets out to explore a random ass dock to build a submarine. And we just get the most beautiful animation you could possibly ever dream of. <laughs> oh, the walking cycle. Known. The door to the crane controls is locked. It's How locked. Am I supposed to get all oh. the way up there? It's Wait. locked. There's a rope leading from that warehouse to the crane. If oh I no! I have to platform. To rope, I can slide over to the crane. Guys, guys, Jimmy walks like he's on rollerblades. How am I supposed to? How am I supposed to platform? This is my favorite one so far. Nice job, team. The game, while being interesting and adventurous at some points and having a villain that I wish was actually in the show, it just kind of falls into the same issue that all these games do, which is just bad design. I remember this song so much. Oh, the jumping. No, don't, don't, don't go, don't go. What am I supposed to do? What do you think? You think I'm going to be able to jump that? I can't, I can barely breathe in this game without exploding. Yep. Oh, I'd better try that again. <laughs> Yeah! Oh, this is so hard. Just one more frame per second, please. I beg. I feel like I'm having a seizure. Ah, fuck, I did it again. God damn it. Sometimes you just think you're doing good life, and then Jimmy Neutron versus Jimmy Negatron comes through just to remind you. Remind you a couple things. All right. Guys, we did it. I just have to move the sub pieces with the crane and put them here on this target. Oh, now I'm allowed to use the space button. Okay. 
Okay. Let's go, Goddard. Monkey. So the main issue of this game, if you want to ignore everything that's going on, is really the controls. You're running, you're running around basically on rollerblades, and the voice acting. Like these are good voice actors. I love Jim Neutron. All of them are phoning it in. Now, if I could just find the opening that leads to Negatron's lab, it's got to be around here someplace. Oh yeah. There it is. I saw it. Oh, and this music too. Oh yeah, these controls, they're yummy. But I, what did I get hurt by? Ow! Let's check oh. it out. Oh, it restarts after every cutscene. That's a feature. That's a fe that's a feature. You don't want it to run out. You remember back when you were a kid and you had like one game to play? And so you used to play it all the time. I remember doing everything possible in these levels, exploring every little thing. Because like, what else am I gonna fucking play? Like, what's over here? Probably nothing. But I would still have explored it. I honestly think this is kind of a bigger point of interest than I really would give it any credit for. The stuff I remember of this game is all music and general bits of location. Like when I think about this game, the stuff I experienced of it as a child was hunting around the map for any little bit of extra content. The stuff where I was actively searching out stuff in the game. The game never gave me any real emotions or connections from itself. It all is born from my own discovery within the game, which I think speaks to the quality of the game. <laughs> that should be his dad. Damn. Atlantis? The architecture. The design. The drum. The drum. Get the stone. We need to move the rocks from that doorway with the sub's grabbing claw. Grab it with the claw. Rise up, my gamers. Grab. Let go. How do I raise up? Get the start. Fuck. Offset. No. No. I missed it. I can't go back. Where am I going? Please don't be a dead end. 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 I can't go backwards. I can't turn around in this place either. No. No! Okay, okay, I'm just going out the mouth. I'm just going out the mouth. Let me out. Let me the fuck out. Let me the fuck out, please. Dolphin. Question, would you guys eat a dolphin sandwich? I'm asking for a friend. I remember being confused by the dolphin. Sorry, I can't read your thing. Kill off. I'll read it in a second. Thank you for coming to the thing. Thank you. Yes! Don't go into the wormhole, Jimmy. Don't go into the wormhole. Don't go into the wormhole. Don't go. Don't. Go, j just go towards the thing. <gasps> yes! Uh, yes! Before I even try and teleport out, let's make sure Negatron doesn't have another trap in mind. I need to alter the dimensional coordinates. Now a minor change to the fucking code and bang! Let's go, boy! The portal is ready! Oh, hey! <laughs> I'm just about to go to bed. I know we couldn't Skype tonight, but. That's alright. Oh, big boy cunt. Is this like the the uh, Mr. X or something from Resident Evil 2? Jimmy's fucked. The Herminator's coming. Why'd he go up there to teleport if he's not going into the pot? What? Mm -hmm. I won't question it. I never question the Herminator. Carl, over here. Hey, Jimmy, what you got there? A small deal. Nothing, Carl. Just some oh. Hey, that stuff looks good. Can I have a sip? Sure, Carl. Just don't finish it. I gotta stop Carl. I'll build a foot shooter to attach to my rocket ship. Gotta get food from Sporkos, too. Sporkos? Fucking Sporkos! Oh, bro. Sporkos? Sporkos. Sporkos! I know, Carl. Don't worry. I'll feed you. Oh, I'll feed you, Carl. So, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna do what the tactic I remember doing as a kid, where I went and grabbed all the food and I just flew in a straight line towards him. <laughs> Alright, Carl. It's time to die. Here he is. Ow, my body! Turn around, Jimmy. The winning tactic. <laughs> Thanks, 
Jimmy. Why did that flurp have a kiss? <laughs> now you may foolishly assume the game can't get any weirder. Well, you're wrong. Jimmy, are you in? May I help you? Yes, but Why are they all? Oh, this is like years into the show. Why are they still using the movie designs? Why don't you come and play with me while you wait for Jimmy? Okay? Okay. Hee <laughs> hee. It ate her! Jimmy Neutron, get me out of here! I don't think that's Libby's voice actress either. I gotta get into virtual reality and rescue Libby! Hello, no, Jimmy, you Jimmy. do not need to get into NFTs. It's fine. I love that they textured the door as just like the, the handle is just a smudge. And I was like, that's good enough. And you know what time it is? Disco time! Is this fucking Tron music? Stop moving, Jimmy! Stop moving! Turn around! I wanna go along this. I don't know why there's a big bug that's um, apparently Vox versus the ugly shrimp. I know, right? Why shrimp's gotta be so ugly? Come here, bro. Fuck you. <laughs> do, 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 do. Now to restore you to normal, Vox. Chester cringed. Fuck you. Thank you, Jimmy. Now, yes, everything so far has been pretty uh, horrific, but there is one part of the game that has always stuck very strongly in my mind as the absolute best part of this game, and that is... Vox, have any of my inventions been activated... I <laughs> claim this will have in the name of Jimmy. Yes, Jimmy. It appears that Jimmy Negatron has used your time machine to try and change the past. <gasps> no! There's no telling how much damage he can do. I gotta stop him. Look at all the kids in costumes. How am I supposed to find Negatron? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> right there, Negatron. <laughs> Come here, you bastard. I'll kill you. I'll kill. Fuck. I'll kill you. Where does he think he's running? Huh? Eh? Eh? Where do you think you're running, eh? <laughs> I'm faster than him. Go catch him. Go catch him. Go catch him. No, Jimmy, no! <laughs> what was that, Jimmy? Jimmy, stop it! <laughs> I lost him completely. Oh. <laughs> Come back here, you bastard. Stop running around the swing set. <laughs> Killed him. You now this. This explains the, sn the, the slippery controls. I've been actually playing on snow this entire time. Come here, you bastard. Come here. Come here. Oh, yeah, you fucking bastard. I'll kill you. I'll kill you and your family. Jimmy has anger issues. Come here! Come here! Stop running from me! So I gotta make it worse for you. Come here! Sick air! Yeah! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Oh! My humor is Chester threatening to kill a video game character and their family while Jingle Bells plays in the background. Yes. Uh, yes. Oh, I remember having so much fun with this as a kid. I loved flying sections and these types of things because it was like actually being in the episodes. But not, not even that, I've just like being able to explore the areas that you see all the time in episodes. I loved it. So where's, uh, where's Dingus? Where's, where is he? Where is he? Where is that sh sugar boy? Where is he? Got it! Where is he? There he is! Ah, I clicked out the thing! Fuck! Why can't I use the, the thing? Using the mouse controls is so shit because it like tries to input the mouse's directions as well. Oh, where, where am I? What's going on? I'm scared. Oh, there he is. There he is. Bring that cake back over here. <laughs> I'm trying to slip around! No, fuck! It's- I'm not touching anything, this is just the mouse's controls. Ow! I literally spend more time fighting the controls. And suddenly, sometimes I just like, zoom all over the place, like, super speed. Like, what am I doing right now? A lot of times I can barely move, I'm like a geriatric old man. What is this? Come back here, you! Fuck! Fuck you! 
No, Jimmy! Work with me! Please stop going on me! Jimmy! Okay. I feel so I feel so American right now. Fuck you! Fuck you! So it's like doing space paddles in no man's sky with a mouse. So just so you know. That was the high point of the game. It only gets worse from here. Speaking of high points, smash that subscribe button. You know you know you want to just do it just do it for me. Just mwah. just that one's just that one's just for you. What is this music? Oh, it's so 60s. Why, why do I feel like something bad's about to happen with this music? <gasps> Money? Why? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, fight me. Fight me, bitch. Okay, I can't fight him. He's too strong. Miss Fowl Satanus. Hello. Whoa. On these rafts to cross the river. Yay. More oh, platforming. Yay. I love more platforming. <laughs> Man, if this game could operate in a few more frames, I would. I would love to be able to jump as well. I'm. Oh, don't die, Jimmy. Don't fucking die and make me redo everything again. Yeah. Die, you bastard! So I could go a long way. Or I could invest in real estate. I'm gonna go the long way. Listen, it's not that hard if you're actually just like dope and really good at games like me. Like, you can, you can 3D platform. I can 3D platform in anything. It doesn't matter if it's a 3D platform or not. I can fucking do it. Because I played these games for breakfast. <laughs> Hell yeah! I don't think Jimmy is forklift certified. I'm just going to chuck that out there. Ugh. Parents, Jimmy. Oh, sorry, Mom. Dad. Oh, don't you try and change the subject, young man. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, wait, whoa, hold, hold, hold on, hold, whoa, whoa, whoa. Is this four guys? Dad, you haven't bought any of that black flurp, have you? Uh, what's this black flurp you're talking about? I've never heard of it. So, where do you have it hidden, huh? I won't tell Mom. Well, I have a crate of it hidden in the garage. For those days, Mom turns uh, grizzly, if you know what I mean. What was that, Dad? He said there's a crate of it hidden in the garage. Uh-oh. <sighs> Now you may think that you've seen everything now, you've seen as cursed as this game can possibly get. Well, you are wrong, because the game decided to pull out all the stops for the finale. Hey Jimbo! I've got a friend that wants to talk to you. Oh, Jimmy, I think you're the greatest, smartest boy ever! Tell me more, Cindy. I think I'm getting sick. Cindy, don't drink that stuff! It's poison! This is what you want. So... Let's get it. Enough talk. I have to get through to the factory and get rid of all that black flurp. Good night, girl. I see you tomorrow. Terminator? This bot needs serious help. Fuck, he's after me. Please, Jimmy, walk in a straight line. Useful with this. <gasps> Piece of metal. I can make some Let's kill him. Let's fucking kill him then. Are you <laughs> sure about that? He's after me! <laughs> come on, come fight me. Come on. I swear, it will go very well for you. Come on, stop hiding over in the corner. I know you might be a coward. And you may be scared me because I have a gun and you're just slowly walking toward me. But that's not my fault. Oh, Come on. Shit. I'm not even- it's not even loaded yet. I swear! Walk towards me, just as slowly, and I won't shoot you. I'll be back. Wow! I hope not. Now, on to the factory. <laughs> I 
I'm gonna go to the bathroom while this music plays. <laughs> Damn, this beat goes hard. Okay, space. Space sometimes is jump, other times is not. Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> I timed it and everything! <laughs> now imagine if like you're in the middle of watching I don't know War of the Rings or something and they're all like running into a battle scene and the epic music goes and then it just like cuts out for a second and then I'll shoot the black bottles down with my water balloon launcher and leave the purple bottles. Gotta make sure I don't shoot the bottles of purple florp. Oh! Wrong one. Fuck! Fuck! Now this is pod racing. Ruined my black florp production! Of course! So, you don't think I'll just make more? I am unstoppable! I am all-powerful! I am... <laughs> Trapped in a vat. Neutron? I can hear you out there. Listen to me. You think you've won? Well, I have a little surprise in store for you. I'm just remembering the fact that this is, you know, the same team that has written some of the greatest cartoon episodes of all time in one of the best Nickelodeon shows. One of them wrote this and thought that that was okay. Uh, that scares me. Really is Ohio. Hell yeah. So being the unwavering defender of the town that Jimmy is, we jumped into the action. Yeah, buddy. Fuck I do, Rufus! I know that shit's wrong! Where are they? Show me those scaly beasts. Go on. Man, they're attacking the burger shop? Absolute bastards. <laughs> Fuck you. What, 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 what did he say? What did he say? <gasps> There's a flying one! Where'd he go? There he is! Old skin bag. Old skin bag. <gasps> skin bag! I'm almost there, boys! I'm almost there! Diggy 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 diggy. Oh, he's after Carl! Not Carl! Fuck, I hit Carl! <laughs> Where, where, what? What? Hold up, wait! I didn't kill him! I not. Where? I am. Oh, okay, they just reset their loop. That's fine, that's. that's fun. I really want to play the old PC version of um, the movie game now. It's so much like this as well. My friend BJ has a consistent comment, which is, Chester, don't you ever play good games that you enjoy and that make you feel good? And I say, no, no, I don't. This is what I play. This is what I like. Am I a masochist? No, it's a children that masochists. He's after the uh, Spankleburger man. Where are you? Where are we going? Fuck, 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 fuck. Binge in it. Hit that drift. <gasps> there he is. Why? Why does it still say there's one left? Oh, okay. Finally over. Oh, no, you goody goody goofball. It's far from over. <laughs> I really wish he'd stop laughing like that. It's annoying. So long, Neutron! What happened to his eyes? Uh, Jim? Yeah, Carl? So, that's the evil you from another dimension? Yep. Okay, um, aren't you gonna stop him? Nope. Hasta la vista, Jimmy! And that's Jimmy Neutron versus Jimmy Negatron. It's a pretty, uh, uh, mmm. 
purposeless game at this point. Like, it, it's really bad, and, like, nostalgia can't even protect it. I played all the time as a kid. The Most of the music is what stuck out to me. Like, that's the stuff that really connected with me. But, man, it's, it's so bad. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe, like, and all that type of stuff. I stream these types of games on my Twitch channel called Tower Transmissions. Check it out over there. We stream, like, multiple times a week, and we'll be releasing videos like this weekly for the foreseeable future. All right, see you soon.